crisis has been tough on all of us. It's also brought out the best in us. Tonight, the story of how some small gestures of hope have turned into large expressions of solidarity as we all fight the virus together. Here's NBC 5's Natalie Martinez. Music. It's become a Friday night tradition throughout the COVID pandemic across the world and right here in the South Loop, 8 p.m. sing along. Humanity. I think it's important to, um, for there to be a concept that brings people together. Tonight, it's Sweet Home Chicago that's bringing people together off their balconies and from their high rise apartment living rooms for those on the front lines. Signs of love are popping up everywhere. Things that don't cost much, but express much. Rainbows in windows from children all over the world are spreading joy, a tradition that reportedly began in Europe, starting to show up across the globe and right here in Chicagoland windows. Victor J. Andrew High School in Tinley Park won't have a regular graduation, but one mom sent us these photos of signs that hundreds of graduating seniors found in their yards, an effort organized by a principal with a huge heart. You may have seen these inspirational signs around town. They're part of a movement we saw born weeks ago with Speed Pro printers in the loop whose employees weren't getting work and started printing. There was no other intent other than just to give people, uh, you know, some inspiration. Soon. A huge current of people wanting to buy these signs and we didn't feel comfortable selling them for our own benefit. So we figured, you know, there might be an opportunity to raise money for a cause that's greater than us. And we chose the Red Cross. The sense of joy that it's bringing them is, is just fantastic. He adds that while they know they're not fixing the pandemic, it's part of being a good citizen and doing it together. Natalie Martinez, NBC5 News.